Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today has been a long and grueling day. So um, I'm back from work and I'm back from a training and my mind is just numb. So I do know that it's a little past the time that I had planned to put out a video. So I thought that I could do something that was really fun and at the same time wasn't labor intensive. So there is this tag floating around that I've seen a couple of the people that I follow do, and it's called, Would You Rather? Now, um, I think Kelly Gooch is the creator of this tag, and I just thought it was something fun that I could do, and I wanted to tag a few people that I follow to see how they would answer the same questions. So if this is something that you would be interested in seeing, then please stick around. Now, the first question is, would you rather have a bad base or bad eye makeup? For me, that is easy. I would definitely say I would rather have bad eye makeup. I just feel like your base is so important because for me personally, I like for my skin to have an even look, no discolorations. I want to hide the hyperpigmentation that I have on my skin. So I just like for my base to look flawless. And truthfully, heck, I feel like eyeshadow, I don't know what I'm doing half the time anyway, so it's always hit or miss. So I definitely would like to have my base done as opposed to my eyeshadow. The second question is, would you whether wear a neutral eye for the rest of your life or a neutral lip? Today, I do have a neutral lip on. And I really have just started wearing neutral lipsticks. Usually I'm more into pinks, uh, fuchsias, reds. So I just started wearing neutral lips and I do quite enjoy them. However, I think if I had to choose, I would rather have neutral eyeshadow than a neutral lip for the rest of my life. But don't get it twisted, I do like both. The next question, would you rather wear a wrong foundation shade or no foundation at all? Um, I have worn a wrong foundation shade many times, many times. I have come home from work looking green because the foundation shade that I had on was definitely not the right shade. So I'm looking over to the side just so I can read the questions. So again, I think I would rather, my base is very important to me. So I think I would rather have a bad foundation shade in hopes that I could fix it with powders, bronzers, and all of that. All of that. But um, if I had to choose, I think I would rather have a bad foundation shade than no foundation at all. And next, would you rather give up a primer or a setting spray? Um, well, I think that's not as hard as I thought it would be. I think I would rather give up a primer because uh, lately as I'm getting ready to go to work, I have to be to work quite early. And sometimes, honestly speaking, I forget to put a primer on. And I really don't know how that could be because it's so hot. I live in Texas and it's so hot right now and I need everything to try to hold my makeup together. But I have... I know over the last few days, there's been at least two to three days that I have forgotten to put primer on or I get in such a hurry that I, I skip that step and then it's just too late to go back. But I always like to have a setting spray because I feel like it melts the powders in your face, it, it seals your look. So even if you don't have a primer, um, I think uh, your setting spray would help to keep your foundations and your powders and stuff sealed in that you know your makeup won't break apart at the end of the day. So I would say if I had to choose, I definitely would rather have a setting spray over a primer. Okay, my next question, would you rather not wear makeup for a year or not drink coffee for a year? That is a hard question. I really can't say how I would answer that. Um, I drink coffee every day, every day. And um, I, like I said, I have to be to work early, so it helps me to get going. 
so I'm not just fatigued all day. But actually, the main reason I think uh, that I drink coffee is because for me, it's an appetite suppressant. Um, so if I had to choose between coffee and not wearing makeup for a year or for or being fat, <laughs> I think I would rather not have makeup for a year rather than give up my coffee. And that's the truth. <laughs> Next question is, would you rather have only 60 seconds to do a daily makeup routine or have to do a full glam one hour transformation every time you do your makeup? Mm, actually, when I do a full face, and I don't say, I don't know really if you would call it a full glam, but when I do my makeup for the day, every day, it does take me a good hour. Now, sometimes I will get my base done and do as much as I can, run to work, and after I do my duty at work, I will run to the bathroom and finish putting my face on. So I would say I normally do take at least an hour. Do I want that to be the norm? No, but it usually does take me a full hour to do my makeup, if not more. But I don't know that I would want to do it every day, but I would not want to um, have 60 seconds. I don't, I don't know what I could get done in 60 seconds. I guess some mascara and some eyeliner. So um, I would say I would take the, I would rather have an hour to do the full glam every day. I think, <laughs> I think that, that's my answer. I'm sticking to it. <laughs> the next question is, would you rather only use mattes or only use shimmers? And I think for this question, I would say I would choose to only use mattes. And lately I have been using my Juvia's Place matte palette and um, I've had it for a while, but I've never really um, have really dived that deeply into it. And so I have been enjoying it a lot. Now, I do like my shimmers. I like my shimmer shades. But um, I think I, with this question, would you rather only use mattes or use shimmers? For this question, I would say I would prefer to only use mattes because I don't want shimmer all over the entire lid. So uh, like I said, I've been enjoying mattes. So I, I think I would say mattes. And the next question is, would you rather not do makeup for a year or never watch another YouTube video ever again? <laughs> I watch YouTube every day. I watch YouTube while I cook. I watch YouTube while I lay in bed at night just before I fall asleep. I watch all my favorite people that I subscribe to. I watch their videos relentlessly. So I watch a lot of YouTube. So as hard as it would be, I would probably say I would rather not wear makeup for a year than to give up my YouTube videos. And the last question, um, one has to go, highlighter, bronzer, or blush? And for me, I'm not gonna say it's easy, but I love to wear my blush, I love to wear my bronzer, and I do enjoy good highlighter. But if I had to give up one, I would say I would give up my highlighter. I'm sticking with that answer too. I do like the highlighter, but I love my blush and bronzer just a little bit more. So those are all the questions in the Would You Rather tag. And again, look at my description box down below to see who I'm gonna tag. I definitely would like to tag um, Colorful Camille. I want to tag, um, let's see, Makeup London. And I wanna tag Bridget. Uh, I think it's Simply Simple, Simply Bridge. It's, I know that's not, I will list it below. But I follow them all the time. Keeping it simple with Bridget, that's it. So I know I definitely wanna tag those three ladies and I may tag a few others. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I did wanna just jump on and bring uh, some kind of busy video to you today. Something like I said, I've been at work all day. It's been a hard day, but I didn't want to miss the opportunity to put a video out. So I hope you found this video fun and I would love to know uh, if you want to answer the questions down below, 
please feel free. It's a fun little tag and I would love to know how you would answer some of these questions. So thank you so much for joining me. Again, I love having you. You're always welcome and wanted on this channel. And until the next time, you guys have a blessed evening. Thanks again. Bye.